Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you all know me, my name is Karne. If you me, then welcome back. This is my first video in a long time, so I'm sorry for the delay in the videos. I've been working hard and trying to live my life. So, without further ado, let's get straight into it. I need to tell you what this video is about. It's about my everyday makeup routine. Yeah, that's it. I'm very original. Yes, I know. First, I'm starting off with Dirty Cover Polish Foundation in the shade Blush Brown. You take one pump on the back of your hand. Then take my beauty blender. I use that as concealer and cover my little marks. Take these right here. So I apply that to my under eye, my frown lines, my upper lip bottom, I mean, above my upper lip my chin and my nose and a little bit on the marks that I had on my cheek. So now we're going to set with powder. I'm using my Cody Air Swim powder. Just take some under my beauty blender. I'm going to let this sit here for a while and brush it off later. Next I'm just going to take a fluffy brush and any fluffy brush would do. And I'm just gonna brush it off with excess powder. Now you could go out the house looking like this, which is perfectly fine. I do this when I go to work. But I'm gonna take my Mega Revolution Reloaded Velvet Rose palette. I'm gonna take this brown shade on the side and use that as the bronzer. Next, I'm gonna take my Ofra Cosmetics highlighter in Rodeo Drive. Just take a little bit of my finger. And that's it for that. Second last step is take your chapstick. Using chapstick, it's in watermelon. Rubbing it on our lips. And now I'll take my Believe Beauty Tropical Punch Lip Gloss. And this is the final look. I tried to take my scarf off, but I always see my videos with my scarf, so you already know the deal. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up, comment, and I'm happy to be back in my YouTube bubble. Hey, like, I don't wear mascara or lashes or anything because it, I wear contacts and it kind of hurt my contacts. So, yeah. But if you like this look, I'll leave the products in the description box eventually. So you know how that goes. It's kind of not hard to put inside the description box, but it's just a little extra. But I got y'all. And I'll see you guys in my next video.